beautiful one. Today, me and my brother are going to be fossil hunting around this landfall. We're going to have a look around the big slabs of shale, hopefully find some fossils amongst them. And then later in the video, we're going to open up some ammonite nodules. Should be a pretty good video. I hope you enjoy it. Me and my brother are out fossil hunting today. There's a landfall behind us. The sea has washed over it quite a lot recently. We're going to have a little look around, see what we can find, and then open up any ammonite nodules if we do find any. Quite a lot of shale has come down with this fall, so I think we've got a decent chance of finding some good fossils today. There's been another similar landfall just behind me. However, we're going to focus on the other landfall, which is right here. So I'll show you around the fall first, and then we'll have a little look about the fossils. After looking around for quite a while, we didn't really find many fossils here at all. So my brother walked further up to a different beach, ended up finding quite a lot of really nice fossils. So we're gonna open a few of them here at this landfall, just near the edge of it. We're not climbing up the landfall, just going to one of the slabs near the outside of the fall. And we'll open up some of those fossils and hopefully reveal some pretty nice ones. Before we open them, I wanted to show you a couple of clips of where we found the fossils and what they look like. This first one is an ammonite preserved inside a chunky limestone nodule. We also have a couple more fossils next, where the fossils were just laying on the beach, perfectly exposed. See if you can try and spot them. This fossil is a little bit different to spot. The entire fossil is exposed on the beach. You've possibly already seen it. I'll just give you a second to make sure you can. We have a lovely pirateized ammonite sat just down there. That's really nice. Similar to the ammonite we've just picked up, I've just seen another one where the ammonite is also fully exposed. Just sat on the beach waiting to be picked up. So I'll let you see if you can spot where that one is. So that one is just up there. A 
couple of really nice little finds. After doing our fossil hunting and finding plenty of ammonite nodules in places we didn't expect, we are going to open quite a few of the nodules up now. I really thought we'd find quite a few fossils around the fall itself, but it must have been well picked over, or the sea needs to wash over it again to reveal some fossils out of it. Either way, let's get opening up some of these nodules. After quite a lot of hammer hits, we managed to open this one. It opened perfectly, so it was definitely worth the persistence to try and open it. We've got plenty more nodules to open up, so let's get on with the next one. We were both very happy with the way this nodule opened, revealed a perfect ammonite again. If you would like one of these nodules to open up yourself at home, please just drop my brother a message on his Instagram page or drop him an email and he'll get back to you as soon as he can. And thank you in advance for supporting our channel. This nodule we just opened broke across the fossil inside of it and the fossil that was inside whoops, was some fossilised faeces also known as a coprolite It's not something that we'll take home today we're just going to leave it here if anyone else comes along and wants to have a look at it So let's open some of the other nodules and see if there's any nice ammonites inside We persisted quite a long time with this nodule, however in the end we could just not manage to open it at all, so we had to abandon this one. This nodule didn't open too bad, the imprint of the nodule broke into quite a few pieces but the actual ammonite itself is pretty much intact and we can prepare it more at home with the finer tools. Got quite a few more nodules to open still.
This is an example of a much more recent, fresher fall. A lot of mud from the top of the cliff has slumped down. It's laying on the beach. There's lots of water still running down as well. So almost certainly there's quite a lot more yet to come down. It's needless to say, it's very important to stay away from very fresh falls like this. We've opened up all of the nodules that we had today. So that's all we've got, unfortunately. Although there was quite a few really exciting ammonites that we did open. One in particular, which was the best by far. So that's all of the fossils for today. We're going to head back home now and hopefully get out fossil hunting again pretty soon. Thank you for watching the video. I really hope you've enjoyed it. And I will see you on the next fossil hunt.